So a lot of people think that to hit the ball like a tour pro, they need to get behind the ball. They need to get their body going this way. They need to get their head moving off the ball. And it's killing your ball striking. Scotty Scheffler and all the other PGA Tour players demonstrate the exact opposite. So I don't know where this lingo comes from, but we need to get rid of it. We need to flush it down the toilet right now. So if we look at Scotty's golf swing, he sets up over the golf ball. And as he approaches the top of his backswing, he even tilts a little bit more towards target this way. So if anything, his head is moving towards a target. And this debunks a ton of things you've heard or probably seen on YouTube about the golf swing. But he's tilting more towards a target at the top than he was at setup. So the tilt is always increasing. If you want to be a great ball striker, you must also increase the amount of tilt you have towards the target in the golf swing. So from the front view, you should strive to stay over the ball as best you can. Why? Because if you start shifting your head off the ball, your contact point on the ground can change in either direction. Forward, backward, inconsistent, no fun, chuck your clubs in the lake. So if you want to be really good ball striker, you would try and not have as much shifting, but instead stay over the ball as best you can. Woo! Explosion off the club face. And that's how the pros get that sound, by the way, that nice crack off the club. Because they're hitting ball first, they're taking a divot in front of the ball. If you're sitting here now saying, dang, for the last 20 to 30 years, I have been trying my hardest to shift my head off the ball, or even starting in your setup with your head behind the ball. These two things have the same effect. They kill your contact. You're always gonna be hitting behind the ball from that position, unless you do something in your swing like shift back. So every action has an equal opposite reaction that you have to manage or maintain in your swing. I prefer to do none of that. Life's too short to play bad golf. I'd just rather stay over it. I mean, you could shift around all day, but that's a lot of work. For the rest of us who really don't want to do a lot of work, and the pros, by the way, don't want to do a lot of work, they practice all the time, so making their life easier, one of the ways they do that is staying over the ball. They'll always hit ball first, they'll always take a divot in front of the ball. If you're somebody who has been behind the ball, like this, gradually getting more behind the ball, your head's going off or away from the target off the ball this way, or even if you're setting up behind the ball, you have to feel Scotty Scheffler's swing in your mind. So you've got to see this top of backswing and increasing that tilt left. So you have to feel his top of backswing position. You're trying to go more this way. Of course, I'm exaggerating, but you want to have that image in your mind that you're going more this way all the way to the top of backswing because you're so used to being back here, the way to get over it is to do a Scotty Scheffler right here. So as I swing really slowly, if I'm shifting, I'd be feeling this. So I want to stay more tilting, 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 tilting towards the target at the top. Pay attention to your head. If your head stays over the ball, you have tilted the right amount. You are going to hit the ball solid. Most of you will say, this feels really weird, Tom. I'm not sure about it. I can't hit the driver, blah, 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 all these things. Trust me, you need to stay over the ball. The pros do it. You can do it too. This is the key for solid contact. You have to make a change. If you're tired of the old program, you got to switch to the new one. You got to change the program. If you don't like what you got right now, change the program. Change to something that's going to hit the ball crispy. So. You've been behind the ball for so long, this feels weird. I need you to feel like tilting. Yeah, it feels weird at first, like everything, whenever you're making a change. But once you start getting used to it, it's gonna feel very natural, very easy, very effortless. Rome wasn't built in a day, but we sure as heck can build it in two days. And if you do this, you'll be well on your way to great ball striking. Now, another way to get excellent ball striking is to check out my free mini course, go.segudo.golf. The top three keys you need to be a great ball striker. Check out the link in the description to start hitting crispy shots just like that. So, 
Scotty Scheffler. He's tilting, he's tilting, he's tilting. What about the driver? Do we tilt with the driver? Yes, we do. You bet your bottom dollar we do. Why would we not? The rules do not change because you got a big stick here with a fat head. No, it's the same thing. The only thing we don't do is take a divot with the driver. So when I set up to this ball, some of you will say, Tom, your head's behind the ball. It's okay. The ball position's more forward. The idea here is that you do not move your head in either direction throughout the golf swing. Keep it in place. Same level and then no side to side movement. Like your head's in a box. Whole swing goes around it. So I got the ball more forward. I stay over the ball. Scotty Scheffler, feel it. As I'm taking it back, he's actually going more this way. He's got the most tilt. He's got an incredible extension. A real nice model for all of us to follow. And then he just swings, he sends it. And then he wins the Masters. And then he puts it on a green jacket. And then he doesn't have to play golf the rest of his life because he can play Augusta National all day long. So it's a good old golfers, you know what to do. Don't get behind, stay over, head in place. Life is good. If you want to build up a golf swing that's consistent, repeatable, powerful, shot after shot, check out my website, sugudo.golf. Complete golf swing training program designed to help you play your best golf right now. Thanks for tuning in today, and I'll see you in a future episode. <laughs>